question. Have you ever received a letter from the Internal Revenue Service or from your state, um, from your local office, and you know that it's something that you do not want to deal with? Like most times you probably don't even open it. Or if you open it and you see that I owe or you owe and it's like, I can't deal with that. And so you close it up and you put it into your filing cabinet or your desk drawer or that kitchen drawer. Let's keep it real, right? Um, and you avoid it. What happens after 30 days, 60 days, 90 days, 12 months? You receive a letter or notice again. Most times they have added interest and penalties. When guys, what I want to say to you all is most times we can reduce that to possibly zero. Now, all situations are different. All circumstances are different. But I want to just jump in here and give this, this brief example. One of my clients received a letter from the franchise tax office. And so insulin, what I just love about and what my clients know about me is insulin, anytime they receive a notice, open it up, make sure you scan it, get it sent over to us because we can get on it as soon as possible, right? And so she received this notice and she was like, what is this? And I get that. I, and I always tell my clients, don't you worry unless I tell you it's time to worry. Okay. So she sent over the notice and it was for um, a balance due of, I think it was $1,400. Give and take. I could be off a little bit with the numbers. For balance due for $1,400 franchise tax. And she's like, what I owe now? You know, why I owe these taxes? What is this? Da, da, da. So I said, don't worry. Just calm down. And it was over the weekend. And um, I took a look at it on that Monday and I began to process her franchise taxes. And we got it to zero. Now, she did have a $50 penalty, but guys, but it went from that um, $1,400 to owing $50 just for late filing, okay? So, again, don't just hide or disregard those notices. Reach out to your accountant. Reach out to, to my firm and myself, and we can support you guys for things that may not be an issue, okay? So, let's have a conversation. If you know that you have received some notices... Um, that you're not addressing, you haven't addressed, if you know you have some tax issues, some tax concerns, you have about taxes um, last year or maybe some um, past previous years, then let's have a conversation. It's probably not as bad as you think, okay? So again, this is Marcia Mayfield just jumping in here to share some support, some guidance, and some assistance. My job is to help make your life easier when it comes to taxes and it comes to finances. This is Marcia Mayfield. Thank you all so much for listening. If you haven't joined our YouTube channel, please do so. Support me. I'm trying to get those numbers up and only you can help me to do that. Thank you all so much and have a wonderful day.